Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and this time I don't really have a specific unlock in mind really. Um, there's plenty of things that we can go out and get. I mean, realistically we should probably be doing some tinted character shenanigans here and there. We haven't played as tinted Bethany in a little while so maybe we'll do like Mother or Beast as tinted Bethany. I can't remember what the Beast unlock is but normally the Beast unlocks are pretty good. Uh, this character doesn't have a champion crown at the minute but we'll get on that. We've got Tractor Beam and Adrenaline Syringe I think that is there. Um, pretty good. I, I'm guessing the Adrenaline... It's not Adrenaline Syringe, it's... It's giving me piercing. I'm not quite sure what that is. Um, booster syringe, whatever it's called from the mod. Oh, baby. Hell yes. And we start with the black feather and the uh, the wicked crown, whatever it's called. But yeah, loaded dice off the bat. We had this recently. We know how good loaded dice um, can be. It can also be a bit of a bit of a problematic item, really. It's it's one of those where it's a lot of fun, but it can kind of screw you over. Depending on the items you end up duplicating, you've really got to get some items that are sort of good to duplicate before you start duplicating. Otherwise, you get stuck in situations where you're getting more and more of the same item that you might not want more and more of. Things like tears ups obviously proved to be a little problematic prior. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, double pill here, honestly. I'll take the uh, the gamble here, considering we got two pills. Range down doesn't bother me at all, especially considering... Um, oh god. Especially considering our range is actually pretty good right now. I think that's mainly due to Tractor Beam though, but eh, whatever. Um, another Lemma Get and Wisp Best Bud. I know that you can sort of influence um, it by standing in certain item pools, but I'm not going to worry about that too much. Now there was a... Um, yeah, unfortunately there's a, there's a Tinted Rock there, but you can't quite reach it, so I'm not going to bother with that for now. Secret Room um, is likely to be here, although not guaranteed. I'm going to check it anyways, yeah. Cool. Um, and we did get ourselves a unmarked thingy rock here, so kind of interesting. We'll just take the hearts and move on. I'm actually pretty happy with those hearts there. As for today's question of the day, um, hmm, what's something that you see often that you find mildly annoying? Okay, now this is kind of a weird one because. Actually, using loaded dice to get multiple cube of meat is not a terrible idea. Um, <laughs> it could actually get pretty out of hand. Do you know what? I'm really down for this, actually. Uh, we might be able to get a run where we get, all, like, basically nothing but um, Lemma Get and Wisps and cube of meat. <laughs> kind of, I kind of like the idea of that. That could be a lot of fun. Um, so we're going to try that out. We're going to try that out. Just going with a bunch of cube of meat, boys. I'm trying to keep our lemma getting wisps to get real items. Not too bad there. Good old Cuba meat here. Um, and I think we're just good to go. Yeah, I think we're just good to go. Um, we're we're potentially gonna do mother here. I we'll we'll see how it goes. We've been doing mother a lot recently. We're actually getting to the point where we've completed a lot of completion marks now. Um, we're, we're getting we're getting closer and closer to having a new dead god save file. Quite nice. It's quite nice. We do got some boiler going on here. Good, good. We'll uh, quickly close those up so we can path across here. Ah, I was really hoping for a red heart in here. Got to remember that picking up red hearts is actually pretty valuable as this character. Yeah, loaded dice. We're not going to get a ton of use out of, I wouldn't think, but we'll try and use it where we can. Um, this guy's going to be annoying. Yeah. Okay, let's try and move out the way before we end up losing some of our wisps here. And we'll get you as well. The little tiny head guys are such a cool design, but goddamn, they're scary. They move at such speed. And that noise is kind of like eerie too. I don't know what the hell's going on with that guy. He was moving around in all sorts of ways. Uh, we don't have a key at the minute, so... Oh, there you go. Okay. Game provideth for us. I'm really liking the fact that we have piercing right now. I, I, I'm still not sure what the item that gave us piercing was. It's some kind of syringe, but good stuff. Baby's breath. I legitimately have absolutely no idea what that is. I've never heard of that item before. Um, so I'm not exactly sure what it does. Right. Give me cube of meat. The only thing that's going to be problematic about cube of meats is we're not always going to get a cube of meat. Because uh, unfortunately... 
Well, you're not always going to have a charge available for every item just because it's a eight room charge. Which is a little bit of a shame, but eh. If this, basically, if our boss item is anything other than stats, we don't really want to take it. Like, well, obviously if it's a range up, we don't... There's, 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 unfortunately, there's going to be a lot of things we don't want here, which is, yeah, not ideal. Uh, because we don't want anything that's HP up, really. We don't want anything that's, like, range up. We don't want anything that's, like, shot speed. We only realistically want to take damage ups, tears ups, and cube of meats. Going to get a little bit wacky. Should be fine here. This guy's a little annoying, but nothing we can't deal with. Still have no idea what this baby's breath has done for us. And then you shouldn't be all too bad either. You're going to move around a lot. Okay, you actually jumped. Oh my lord. Okay. You've taken away one of our items. I think it was just lost friend though, so I really don't care. This guy's kind of tricky. Having a little bit of a hard time killing him. It's, it's a pretty cool boss design. Okay. Didn't didn't realize that creep was going to get me there. Okay. Yeah, having a hard time actually lining up and hitting him here. But there you go. Eventually got him. So this is good. This is Tears um, of Soul Heart. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll take that. We're not going to go Devil Deal here, of course. Um, ooh, we should be taking red hearts to save up for loaded dice, actually. Right, yeah, we're not going to take that. We're just going to go to the next floor um, and be f reasonably happy. Okay. I'm a happy chappy. Let's continue on. But this, this is going to be a bit of a weird run, I think. Bit of a weird run. I'm just hoping every loaded dice use gives us a cube of meat, honestly. It's all I want. Good. There's another cube of meat for us, or potentially white rose, but I'm hoping it'll be cube of meat. Use Lemmageddon. We, we want to try and avoid using red hearts for Lemmageddon at this point. Okay. I see now the water indicates where they're going to fall. We need something going to spawn us. Like, we need Gimpy. You're going to spawn us a bunch more red hearts or something. That guy got a bomb in his head? No. That guy's got a leech in his head, though. I see that. Good, good. Ooh, extra soul heart. Pop that. Leftover takeout. All stats up fortune. Interesting. Okay. We're going to take damage here if we're not careful. I really don't like this fortune in our face here. Unfortunately, we got that item that just covers your face in fortunes constantly. Let's go do the boss now. Ooh, this is an interesting boss. So yeah, all stats up, but we've got most of our screen covered constantly by fortunes. My biggest problem with the fortune thing, I think it's a, it's a pretty interesting item because it's got like a unique downside, is that some fortunes are fucking huge. Like, I wouldn't mind it if most fortunes were the same length, but some of the fortunes take up like so much of your screen. Uh, that's a good item. Um... Okay, let's let's not take it yet though. Come back this way first. Magic fingers, you become hopefully cube of meat, but you know for a fact it's just gonna give me the rose. Even though I'd be happy enough with the rose. Oh no, I get two cube of meats. Good, good, good. I like the cubeth of meat. But yeah, this might be like the earliest cube of meat boy anyone's ever had. Be a little careful around that guy. My meaty boy doing his thing. Oh, God, these enemies can be really problematic, though. Oh, dude, get off me. Hey, a red heart. Lovely. Okay, um, right. We want to go do our fire. Good stuff. Did, did we have anything that was over gaps? I don't think we did, did we? Um, let's go into our cash room first here. Uh, I was like, where's the last enemy? Uh, I don't think I want to use that. I don't, even know if I, I don't even know if I can. Right. 
touch that bad boy again. Into our mirror room we go. That is a shit ton of money. Um, wait, let's let's not blow it up yet because we need to see if we get an additional bomb first. That is a lot of money there, though. There's an additional bomb already. Good, good, good. Let's grab that. Let's... Kill those guys. Right. Back through here. We can go into the mirror realm more than once, right? Dude, I... Uh, one second, okay. Okay, okay. Hold off, hold off, hold off. Right, first of all, let's blow this up. All this money. Right, then we go back over here. We can pop this now. That's fine. Hurst on Toast is fine by me. Um, oh, we got a little little boy dude around us. What's this little fella? Uh, right, anyways, we come into here. We do this. Get our fourth level cube of meat. Then we come back. We go back in here. Which I've never actually done before, but yeah. Can. We'll try and get another bomb from here. Yeah, why is one of my wisps just a, a little glob dude? Confused by that. Right, we're doing this for the charges, but also for the potential chance at an extra bomb. We've got a top hat, uh, which is pretty good, actually. We'll pop that. Pop that top hat. Ooh. The Eternal D6 is very, very nice. Quickly just do that. Cool, extra key there. Yeah, the extra charges are mainly what we care about here. Can we buy that red heart? Yes, we can. Lovely. I'm hoping for one extra bomb here. I'm not going to get it, are we? Nice. I don't... I'm not sure about doing the boss again here, because I wasn't really that confident on what the boss did, but I'm going to give it a go. Just because I'm killing him pretty quick. Cube of meat. Give myself a boss item here. A little gear, it's not a boss item, but it's something. Right, back this way. Back through the mirror. We didn't get an additional bomb, sadly. We can't get all that additional money right there. We need to go to the mines. Technically, we don't need to go to the mines, but I'm I'm imparting that rule upon myself. I need to go to the mines. Right, quickly check this out. Fortunately, not a lot of good in here. We'll take the soul heart, though, of course. Okay. So far, I'm pretty down to clown with this run. It's weird, but I like it. Right, double bomb this bad boy. Cool. <laughs> Loaded dice with the ability to like use hearts to charge it is pretty fun. Ah, really? Only that? And then we're still able to get other items. This is like the perfect character to get loaded dice on. Be able to play around with it like this. Uh, I'll bomb this open, just for the chance at hearts. Uh, mm, do you know what? No, not yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait and see uh, if I get a charge before I find my item room first. Oh, dude, I didn't, I really didn't expect that to like travel up the wall like it did. Did lose some health there. I probably shouldn't have done. Let's do this first. Small rock's good. Um, although, while small rock is good, 
We might not want it to be small rock. Cracked dice is what it is. Bit of shot speed, why not? Good, good. Pop that. Mad onion. Can't be taking any of that. Right, first of all, let's grab small rock. Good old Cuba meat. <laughs> I'm loving this. This is so stupid. Right, now we can do this. We want the charges. Did not expect to see an item. Did not expect to see Flatstone as one of those items. Now, Flatstone is an item that doesn't stack, so won't take priority. So I'm a little more okay with taking Flatstone. Although, I'll be honest, I, I don't really want it. <laughs> I'd rather have another, another friend. Oh, I didn't expect that bomb to hurt me. Right. So, of all the items I want to take so far, flat, uh, flat onion. No, mad onion is the one that I want, really. Right. Get you out. Give me more red hearts, game. Come on, you know you want to. Plastic bag is fine, I think. Yeah. Now that... That's just too, too much of a fortune. Come on now. Right, we'll go change over Flatstone in a second to hopefully another cube of meat. I'll take this because it's uh, a bomb we don't have. I've got something that's turning enemies into other enemies. It's like downgrading them. Come on. Yeah. Crack that open. Ooh. Um. This I'm just going to buy. This is like one of the first items because it's just more charges. So I'm going to buy this as it is. It does spawn a battery. So we'll go back over to Flatstone. I'm fairly close to secret rooms right here, actually. I'm going to try that out. Ah, you goddamn copper bomb bastard. Right, back over this way. Lovely. But yeah, 20%, if it stacks, it's even better, but 20% chance to get a charge on room clear, and then getting a battery on pickup, it's pretty good stuff. I don't know whether, which one the battery will go to first, though. Thank God, it went to the right one. Good, good. Cool. This is kind of a difficult room when you can't see much, I'll be honest. I managed to do it somehow, though. Okay, so we'll definitely trade that for fourth level cube of meat. Thank you. Okay. I think we're just going to take Mad Onion at this point. Can't buy the Soul Heart quite yet. Although, I, I'll be honest, I don't really want to take Mad Onion. It feels bad to leave it. And I don't think it'll stack. But I'll just take it. But know this. I didn't really want it. Right. Down we go. <laughs> I'm loving this. We've got two max level cube of meats. I didn't expect that. I can't believe we've still got, um, what's it called? Mom's keys, good, especially before picking that up. Lovely. 
of that. Key there's good. We are full up on blood. Oh, dude, these enemies are tricky as shit. Let's not waste charges here, game. I just, yeah, just despise, as always, not having mapping. I'll never shut up about it. It's always going to be a constant for me. I'm always going to be annoyed about not having mapping. More red hearts is good stuff. Soul of, Soul of Lilith. Peach Creep. Don't be duplicating Peach Creep now. Didn't really think about that when I did that. Oh, dude, Mum's key is amazing right now. Right, pop in here. Jumper cables. Okay, I will be taking jumper cables as well. I'm diversifying too much. I'm getting, getting antsy now. In here we go. Ah, oh, dude. Ah, oh, dude. I should have used loaded dice again. I've got another charge of it. Goddamn peach creep, man. What's that in there? Soul of Keeper? Ah. Oh. Yeah, I didn't see that that was bomb rocks. Damn it, peach creep. I've diversified too much and I've created myself a, a horrible system here. We are no longer a cube of meat only family. Now we've got two peach creeps that sit directly on top of one another, apparently. Oh, dude, what the hell? <laughs> Just fucking ran right into me. There we go. That's more like it. Um, I'm going to do the rest of this floor. Try and get some extra charges. And potentially some more HP. Don't know why I thought that was secret room. I just had a feeling. I don't know how much of this floor I've actually not done, to be honest. Probably not a lot of it that I haven't done. Like a f okay, this is, yeah. There's like one, there's like no, none of it we didn't do. Okay. Okay, at least I got some HP. I didn't actually know there was a tinted rock, but thank you. Right. We are Gucci. We are golden. Where we go? It's the right way, I think it is. God damn peach creep, man. Why does Solar Lilith have to give me such a downer of a uh, familiar? Right. Down we go. <laughs> this has been such an interesting run, man. XL floor here. Oh, God. Apple. Don't mind a bit of apple. Not products. Apple products are dog shit, but... Apple as an item? Not bad. Okay, well, this is annoying. Ah, no, tractor beam's finally gone. Super depressing. Those guys are such dicks. <laughs> Those enemies right here were just gonna spawn right next to the door. But by the way, if you actually, um, if you actually try and attack us, we'll just instantly hurt you. It's 
the deal with this room then? How do I get over there? Um, yeah, what's what's the deal here? This room's not meant to work like that, right? Confused by that. I was deeply confused there. How did that not kill you? What the hell? Akeldama? Big old bomb. Do you know what? I'm going to do one boss now. Just to make sure I'm not wasting charges completely, because otherwise I'm wasting lots of potential charges. Oh my god, the amount of bombs there was insane. Ah, Peach Creep. Yeah, fucking give me another cube of me. I'm wasting a heart for that, you know it. I'm not having another goddamn Peach Creep ruin my time. I will get to a third max level cube of me, you know it. What are you fellas? Any black hearts for me here? Nope. Badly not. Little Chad. Ooh, little Chad. That's more red hearts. That's good. Where's that item rooms at, man? We're just wasting charges right now. <laughs> I can barely see most of these goddamn rooms. Can't, I can't hit that. Use the money, wow. What the hell? Stack up as many red hearts as we can. The trail's actually decent now, nowadays. These guys attacking each other's kind of fun. Yeah, unfortunately we're wasting so many charges potentially here on all these random rooms that we're entering. I think we've lost Mum's key as well, sadly. I've had more bombs, I just bomb out and then come back to some of these rooms. Once I know they're the wrong way, but I don't really have the bombs to sustain that. Oh, come on now. Yeah, it's just, it's just ridiculous. There's so many rooms before the item room. At least we're getting consistent red charges now. Ooh, kidney stone's good as well here. Apparently not right now, though, because none of this is what we wanted. Soul heart there, right. Come in here. Mad onion. God damn it. Go to the shop first. Ah, oh, dude. Ah, oh, fuck you, game. This is gross. All these wasted charges. You're not even giving me the cube of meats that I deserve. Alright, back to the scene of the crime. <sighs> there you go, baby. Right, one more of those bad boys. Good thing is, the more of them we have, the higher chance they have of appearing. We are still going to be getting consistent red heart drops. Honestly, let's take that for more red heart drops. I don't think we lost any damage through that either, so it's fine. Okay. Ah, uh, bugger. Oh, I actually didn't get hit by that brimstone there. Lovely. More charges. Lovely. Little monster. He is cute. That is true. Okay, 
now that's a lot of brimstoning. Go my meaty ba babies. Right, back we go again. There's going to be a lot of this back and forth malarkey here. And it better, it better not re-roll it into Peach Creep, I swear. I don't even know why I took the second Peach Creep. I really shouldn't have. Oh, oh, oh no, it was a mystery item, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. I, I couldn't have avoided taking it. That's fine. I feel better now. <laughs> I've calmed myself down. There's only goddamn two of them. Why does it keep giving me goddamn Peach Creep? You need to stop, game. You really need to stop. I'm gonna get real upset real soon. Right, we've potentially got enough runes left to get another charge, so let's not let's not get too upset just yet. The thing is, the mystery item might just be a cube of meat, and I'm re-rolling it again, so it's kind of annoying. Excuse me, why didn't I fire that? I know I've got kidney stone, but I charged up for ages. Hoping for more red hearts than that, but sadly not. Mum's heal. Wowie. Okay, I have lost a lot of my good Lemmigate and Wisps by the look of things. Okay, we've got another charge already. I think the lantern thing plus, um, what's it called? The lantern plus... Lantern battery, whatever it's called, plus uh, jumper cables are serving us very, very nicely as well, to be honest. I think we're getting quite lucky with that. Right, game. You know. You know I don't want Peach Creep here. Don't you? You know I don't want Peach Creep. You know I want another cube of meat. Thank you. Finally, my third boy. All I've ever wanted is three whole cube of meat boys. Do you reckon we can get a fourth before the end of the run? I'm I'm saying it's pretty unlikely, but we we can we can certainly try. We can certainly try. The problem is the amount of items we have left to reroll, not the amount of charges we can get. There's likely to be no more items we can reroll on this uh, floor. Unless we can manage to get a charge and then reroll the negative and the Polaroid, potentially. But that's a risk, because we'd be losing guaranteed damage. Oh, that hit me? Wow. That's a very good hit. I forgot we had another item room waiting for us, I'll be honest. Oh! I, I know where we've lost a lot of our damage. The fortune cookie item's gone. Dirty mine's decent. I'm, I'm confused about the amount of cube meats we've got and the amount of uh, stupidity in terms of the rerolls we're getting here. We've only got one Mad Onion. Why does Mad Onion keep showing up? I didn't even think Mad Onion could stack. That's kind of why I took it. I didn't think Mad Onion would be a problem, like, at all. You're going to throw your heads or what? Oh my god, you baited me so hard there. I don't even know how much health I'm on right now. It's probably not good. Okay, so at this time, we are probably going to have to take whatever the mystery item is. Unless we can get two more half red hearts from somewhere. Hmm. Put that blow up so it stops being an asshole. Right, go back to the arcade for a hot minute here. See if blowing up the confessional can give us a red heart. Hmm. 
No, but it did give us a lot of money. Really help. I don't think blowing up you does anything for us. Technically, it could give us a charge, yet, yeah, I was about to say, it gave us a pip after getting that kill, so that's something. Bag of seeds is not bad. We do have a, a blood bag in one of the rooms over here. Hmm. How does this work exactly? Can we not get the blood back? I don't think we can. Damn it, that's a big shame. Hmm. Shop was a bust. Uh, technically killing you counts as a kill, right? Damn it. Hmm. Trying to suss out any other which way we can get either one red heart or a kill. <gasps> there it is. Did have to take myself the heart of damage for that, so my health is probably even more compromised than normal now. Right. Back over this way we go. And we got a herb, it gives us a cube of meat. Just with the amount we have, you'd think it'd basically be guaranteed. Like, 90% chance of it happening. So I'm really hoping we don't get another goddamn mad onion here. I'm gonna be a little annoyed if we get peach creep on mad onion again. Fucking peach creep. Ah, oh, thank god. Cuba meat. Thank goodness. The game was somewhat reasonable with our second choice there. Right, boss time. That going, good, good. We got an angel deal here, I wasn't expecting that. Right, good, good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sorry, Jesus Juice. Um, We should try and kill you, at least. Yeah, sorry, Jesus Juice. You're just... You're not it. We did get two uh, Lemmageddon hearts, though, which is even more Lemmageddon wisps. Next floor, which I very much like. Don't like the fact that I didn't manage to kill those laser eyes, but Peach Creep actually did something for us for once. We are going to lose Lemmageddon wisps here, and probably a lot of them. This is going to actually really fuck us up. <laughs> the next floor. In terms of our actual power. Did get a red heart out of it, though. <gasps> the angel deal's still open! <gasps> it's empty! How dare you, game. That was a cruel trick. Anyways, down to the next floor. Has anyone ever had this many cube of meats? Okay, our health is actually way, 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 way better than I expected it to be. Now, I don't like the fact that I just got completely wrecked there. What's going on with my tears? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. We got planet to planet toyed, whatever it's called. Oh, we just get fruitcake though. Um, how am I going to get rid of this planetoid thingy? Because it's going to mess me up real bad. Nah, it's fine. We'll deal with it. We'll just deal with it. Fruitcake is amazing. I've got to say. That's what I was looking for. Fucking Peach Creep. My goodness. Getting very annoyed at Peach Creep. Never wanted you in the first place. Just coerced yourself into my goddamn pocket. Through trickery. Foul trickery. 
We are now only two cube of meats away from our fourth full boy, though. I'm, I'm very pleased about. As if we got fucking planetoid here. So goddamn annoying. I'm gonna die in a less annoying way, please, enemy. Okay. Token bag. Token bag could be kind of useful, I suppose. There's reasons why I could want to use it. Yeah, gotta fight the wall. Nah, I'll stick with the trinket I've got right now. Ooh, arcade could be good. For a lot of money. Damn it, was very much hoping for a crane game here. Although, these have been proven to be pretty good in the past, so let's, uh... Green key is pretty good. Do these one at a time, because he can give us bad, uh, spiders. Okay. Okay, you just bombed yourself. Well done. Okay, managed to escape it narrowly. Blue key this time. I doubt this works, but whatever. Yeah, we can still, we still have to give him the keys, I thought so. Oh, you hopped that right onto my head, you bastard. Where's the item? Give me the item. I don't want the keys, man. I don't want another red... Oh, come on. I mean, red heart's decent. Yeah, I'll take it, but it's not really what I was looking for. Crazy jackpot. Okay. I'm stressing myself out over my need, my absolute need to get um, more Cuba meats. <laughs> I'm overplaying this, but this is what I love about modding. Like this um, loaded D6, just nothing like this would ever be possible in vanilla. It's so weird and strange and wacky. Tell you what, though, getting a little bit annoyed about how much damage I'm taking. I'm taking a lot. I have no idea what happened there. Right, boss time. Mr. Dead's a fun one. Have we still got fruitcake in the mix? Because I feel like I'm not seeing fruitcake really going off anymore. Which is unfortunate. Which... Annoys me. Oh no, I think I saw a fruit kick in there. It's, it's hard to tell. No, I do, I do. Beautiful stuff. Ow. Dude, my HP right now is so bad. Um, right, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna take the prism, just because I think it's actually gonna be kind of useful. Yeah, I'm gonna take the prism, and I'm gonna fight this other dude. And I'm gonna load a dice and hope for my last thing. Um, it didn't re-roll... What I was hoping it would. Okay, th there's my cube of meat. Good. Don't know why I have an extra key piece now, but there you go. Right, so health is not in a good spot, really. Um, but we did manage to get up to our last cube of meat, boy. 
yeah, I'm I'm happy enough. We might still die here because our health is pretty dire, but um, let's just let's just try our best to keep things going here. And try and let our swarm of meat boys just annihilate everything. I guess. Thunder thighs, really. Don't be having lots of walk over stuff now. Like rocks and stuff that could hurt us. Yeah, I want to take Angelic Prism because with this uh, thing where our tears are circling around us, it's a hell of a lot easier to pass through. Oops, all heart. Oh, that makes me happy. But yeah, tears really, really aren't, um, aren't the main focus of this run at all, are they? We did find the boss very quickly here as well, which is very nice to see. I'm going to do one more room to get one more charge. I'm also going to bomb this real quick. Okay, we got a charge here. Nice. Mum's stockings. Wow. Okay. Boss time. We'll see how this goes. This is going to be very passive gameplay, I think. We're very much going to let our... Uh, let our friends do the majority of the work here and see how that goes. Now, we are going to lose the vast majority of our Lemmigate and Wisps here. Very, very quickly. But we just do what we can. We've still got Fruitcake for now. We've still got Planetoid as well for now. I'm not liking our low, low speed that we've got currently. Okay, this is a little bit harder now because uh, we're having to deal with our boys chasing this guy around and not being able to do damage the majority of the time. He likes to move it, move it a lot. Why have we still got Thunder Thighs of all the items to still have? At least we've still got Fruit here. That's a bit of a blessing in disguise. One second, just need to itch. At least we're still able to do the bomb trick with this guy. I love that bomb trick. It's so good. Come on, my meaty friends. Oh, he's, he's just going for it. He's just going for it every time. Dude, he's going for it again. I've only got one bomb this time, though, so... Makes life a lot easier. That attack is far easier than the rest of the ones he puts out. Anyways, with us and our QB boys, with how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 cubes of meat. We finish off this run. I hope you guys did enjoy.